Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today will be another DIY video and this video is a part of collaboration for the boys that is uh, we are started this last month and we had so much fun uh, doing the crafts for our man's boys boyfriends whatever I had made it for my husband so and my dad got a little bit of jealous so we have decided to continue doing it so this month's theme again as I said it is a collaboration for the boys and the theme is to create a craft or DIY for uh, a man uh, or with a man in our life so let me show you quickly on the screen who are participating in this collaboration and briefly introduce you to my friends that I'm collaborating today. Okay, so for this collaboration, I got my lovely friends, Marika's Creation, Dandy Soap DIY, Pets Home Craft, Chemo Craft, Country Girl Attic, Susan Gathaway DIY, and Jackie Burns Creation. So I hope you guys checked all of them out. They are all are lovely people and amazing creators. Okay, so those are the lovely people that are participating with me in this amazing collaboration. If you don't know neither one of them, I will really advise you to go check it out. All of them are amazing DIYers, crafters, and just became uh, wonderful friends to me. All the information about them will be linked in my description box below along with the playlist if you like my video and want to see more for the boy theme videos there's a playlist link click on it and continue watching but for now let's get to the craft and i'll show you what i have created for my man okay so i got two dollar tree baskets that i will be painting using my rust-oleum gloss and it is says it's sun yellow color Okay, so I will be using a Dollar Tree pizza pan and for the paint I'm gonna use my Rust-Oleum satin and it's supposed to be a matte canyon black. So we'll see how this is gonna turn out. Okay guys, as you can tell, both of my baskets are dry along with the pizza pan and I did print out a sticker that is saying Pittsburgh Steelers. So I will use that as my header for my little table. So now what I will be using is my E6000 to glue both of my baskets together along with the pizza pan at the top. So, but I made a small mistake. I forgot to insert um, my stones and a little plant inside the basket at the top because that will give me the weight so the table will be stable so I'm really sorry but I don't have a footage of that because I had to redo it after I glue it together I have to take it really quickly apart and I forgot to film it but you get an idea you need something heavy instead of in, inside the middle of the basket so it will stay and don't tip over when you use it as a table. Okay, so my creation is uh, all done and steady together. Now I cut my sticker. 
Well, it's kind of not a sticker, I guess I'll call it a sticker. It's a printout that I printed and I'm using that Elm's glue to glue it to my top of the table, which is the pizza pan. And then in addition, I will be using the Mod Podge all over the top of the pizza pan to seal it all together so it can get wet and nothing's going to get ruined. Okay, next step, I decided to make two coasters and I had these two wood pieces that um, I have a set of 20, I think I bought it. So I decided that it will be a perfect, well, at the beginning, I'm going to paint them all black at the top, then let it dry. Then again, I went back to my printer and print two little football printouts. I cut them in the shape of this uh, wood piece and then I glue them together on top of it and with the, just the regular Elms glue and again on the top I use my Mod Podge to seal it and voila my little coasters are ready for the beer. And at the end for the final shot, I was trying to make a video for you of the plan that I have inside and my kitty would not leave me alone. I think I did it for him as a puzzle and he's trying really being sneaky about it to figure out how he can get to that plan inside. But not going to happen. It's all sealed. Well, that was all for today. As you guys noticed, my second DIY was a Steelers theme again. We are the Steelers family. Obviously, my husband is from Pittsburgh, even though we live in the heat, Austin, Texas. I love it. He doesn't, but I do. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my craft. If you did, and if you're one of my new people, please let me know in the comments below so I can welcome you to my small little YouTube family. And if you're one of my returning, thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate your love and support. Don't forget guys, there's a playlist link in the description below with more videos for in the theme for the boys. And I also want to say thank you all of you lovely people my some of some of you guys are my new friends i really enjoy collaborating with you and i cannot wait for the next one but it is all for today bye for now